I remember this issue also when we were saying, you know, sometimes when you do elections for the process, it's either you get positive results or you get negative results. And then here in Kenya, it brought in a very negative impact because some of the people who thought that they are the one who brought this federation to life were kicked out, not kicked out deliberately, but because of elections. And now these people got angry and they, 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 they tend to divide themselves from the actual federation. And they, they went away to say, we better start our own federation. But on top of that, they were still demanding support from the, NGO, the same NGO and the SDI secretariat. So for that time, it brought a bit of tension between the leaders of, of, of Kenya, whereby SDI was now forced to intervene. I remember when we came to the meeting, we were at a hotel where we were trying to intervene on this tension. But you can see that these leaders were eager to still come back. But because of pride between the two parties, the connection couldn't work properly. But we came up with the ideas of saying, let's forget about being the NEC. Let's focus on saying we are the leaders that has to build our federation. And these leaders who broke away because of not being elected went away and thought twice to say, we will come to you on condition. So we even said to them, conditions will never build a proper relationship. So we left them with a homework to review themselves and make sure that they should think where they come from. And then being elected or, or not being elected will never serve the purpose because they have built this process with their commitment. And then now they are being frustrated because they are not getting that uh, election right or maybe supporting them. So after some time, we heard whilst we are communicating that gradually they are thinking of coming back into the Federation.